Hey everyone, we're here at Korg, and this is the Nano Key Studio, a Bluetooth MIDI controller in Korg's Nano lineup. And this is a video that's going to show you how to update your Nano Key Studio or Nano Control Studio or Micro Key Air on Mac or PC to the latest firmware update. So it will work over Bluetooth with iOS. The first thing that we're going to want to do is make sure the on switch on the Nano Key Studio is all the way to the left, which will put it into USB mode and we want to turn it on, but in update mode. So press the octave minus and sustain buttons and plug in the USB cable that's connected to your computer. And now we're in update mode. These four lights will light up. Now we can move over to our computer and download the update for free by going to the Korg website and going to the product page for your controller and downloading the update, then launching the update and the update software will actually tell you whether your controller needs a software update. So if it does run the software update, this may take a minute or two, and when it's done, it will let you know to turn your controller off and on again. So let's do that. And now we can turn our controller back on, but in Bluetooth mode, in this case, by turning the switch on the Nano Key Studio to the right, and it's going to turn on in Bluetooth mode and we can move over to our iOS device. And you can now see it in the list of available iOS devices when you're in the Bluetooth controller settings of a Korg app, for example, or use the Bluetooth MIDI app available in the App Store to connect to other software on your iOS device and just simply select the controller and you're ready to go. So that's how you update your Nano Key Studio, Nano Control Studio, or Micro Key Air to the latest update, which will allow it to connect to iOS devices over Bluetooth. And if you have any questions, let us know in the comments below, and we will see you next time.